by Rhinosaurus Hex and the Unluckiest Day Ever. Written by Mr. J. Illustrated by Gary Wilkinson. In the dense patch of jungle with the sun beating down, lay Enda the T-Rex on the ground with a frown. What happened? asked Bull, her dinosaur friend, as playtime came halting to an unwelcomed end. Injured and angry and holding her knee, Enda snorted, I tripped on the trunk of that tree. There's nothing to question, no reason to doubt. That bad luck always follows when I'm out and about. She got herself up and brushed herself off, kicking up dust that caused her to cough. There's an ugly black cloud floating over my head, and I'd be better off staying in bed, Enda said. So, now what? asked Bull, still wanting to play. It's too soon to go home on such a nice day. But Enda stayed grumpy and in a bad mood. I guess we can hit the cafe for some food. A big scoop of ice cream will cheer you right up. Blueberry dream with nuts in a cup. Enda's mood brightened as they walked down the street, thinking about the great treat she would eat. But the cafe was mobbed with dinosaur kids and mammoth and turtles and two white-eyed squids. Who stood in a line that seemed not to budge? ordering mint chip and chocolate and vanilla stripped fudge. When they finally reached the front of the line, they gasped as they read a very bad sign that stated, to Anda's utter dismay, we are sorry but for the remains of the day, we broke our machine that makes fruity cream and are no longer serving blueberry dreams. More bad luck, Anda stomped around and snorted, her cheeks burning red and her features contorted. Come on, let's go home. This hex is a pain. And oh, look at that. It's starting to rain. They walked toward her house, getting soaked along the way. As Enda moaned it on, what a terrible day. Back in her kitchen, they had water and cake. And Enda complained, I cannot catch a break. This terrible hex has run all amok and given me nothing but horrible luck said getting rid of bad luck is a worthy objective and it's simply a matter of changing perspective let's think about all that has happened today but let's look at it in a more positive way you tripped and you fell it happens to all at one time or other we all take a fall but you got right back up it could have been worse so it's hard to believe it was caused by a curse. And the cafe couldn't make your blueberry flavor, but you could have then tried a new flavor to savor. And yes, it was raining and that was too bad. But that's not a good reason to start feeling mad. This day didn't have to be a big dirt. We could still have had fun and played in the mud. His words had made sense. What he said sounded true. Perhaps all she needed was a new point of view. For a while, they stayed quiet, so Enda could think, as Bull stood back up and went to the sink. I will get you more water. No thanks, she told Bull. For the very first time, my glass is half full. The end.